good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, sir. Uh, we would like to meet you officially. Uh, we understand that you are one of the panelists, and we would like you to tell us your name, and you tell us why you are to honor this invitation to be one of the speakers for today. Um, thank you very much. My name is um, Yemi King. I'm a portrait photographer. And um, I mean, this event is one of the biggest events that we have that um, brings photographers together from all parts of the country for us to have life changing conversations, for us to really have impactful conversations. So um, when I was um, sent the invitation to be a I couldn't refuse such a platform because one, personally I've come and I've learned a lot. I knew I was going to learn a lot and I did. And also I get to share some of the lessons that I've learned with other creatives. So it's a beautiful um, event. It's a beautiful platform and I think we are blessed to have this in this time in the Nigerian photography and in the Nigerian creative industry at large. Okay, thank you so much. Uh, when you are, you know, talking to the audience, I heard you mention of uh, people should create niche and be unique in their own style. Yes. But most of the challenges that I feel a lot of young people face these days is when they take a picture that is not acceptable by uh, their clients and try to show them, look at what somebody took me in school or in party or somewhere. and. For the fact that they are struggling financially, I think that's why most of the people copy other creatives because they will have to find a way to steal that idea the person created. That's what I think. What do you? I feel the the challenge to be excellent in what we do is something that we all must embrace and. As much as we must embrace that, it's equally important that we have a voice and we have an identity as creatives. Now, the question I'm going to ask is, what sets you apart from the create from the photographer that is or our own image was the one that sent to you was sent to you? Why was that person's work perceived? as better or why is that person's work perceived as a standard for your own work i mean so i think the journey to excellence is one that we all must take and yes can we learn from others yes but must we end up being a photocopy of other people that have succeeded no but are there things that we must learn from people that everyone generally agrees that they are good at what they do yes and must we allow ourselves to be boxed into replicating the jobs that other creatives have done I strongly disagree. That's all for now. Thank you so much for your time. And the presentation was excellent. We really enjoyed and had a nice time with you, sir. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you so much.